Hi, I'm Rebecca Fox, I'm the manager of Kindillan and I've been very lucky to actually be appointed in this position since 1999. Kindillan is well recognised as being one of the best outdoor education centres along the eastern coasts and we now have over 12,000 clients who come here each year. We're based on 220 acres of natural bushlands and we have 178 beds and with growth um, predicted in the future with more accommodation and halls. And we do a whole range of specially designed outdoor education packages, very focusing on the education and specific outcomes that you desire. So at Kindillan, we're really lucky. We are very, very local to Brisbane City and also the Gold Coast. So we do attract a lot of clients who come here for half day and also full day workshops. But we also mainly attract people to come here for three days. That includes two nights, fully catered, fully programmed. We tailor programs instead of saying this is a year three camp or this is what we provide for year sevens. When, when you first make a phone call to us, we talk to you about your objectives, what do you hope to achieve by coming out here at Kindillan. And then we actually work with you and designing the program from scratch. We're here, we're keen, what we got? We also run programs off-site as well. So we can come to your school or your work environment or your community group and actually run initiatives and team building and problem solving activities for you. We've got a very mobile unit. At Ken Dillon, it is a real journey through your experiences. So we have outdoor education staff who stay with you for the whole time, which builds a real rapport with that group and a real understanding of their needs, coming down to the individual again and also the group needs. It also means there's a bit more flexibility in the program. So there's more time to allow for reflection and for discussion. And when they want to up the ante to really get the, the adrenaline going, they can spend more time doing that because they know their group very, very well. Hi, my name's Ben. I started here about six years ago on my uh, work prac and uh, now I'm one of the managers here at Kindillan. When I first came to Kindillan, uh, there was nobody around on site. I just got taken around in a quiet bush and I was sort of like, yeah, it's a beautiful place, but uh, there's not a lot happening here. I soon realised after a couple of weeks here that it's, it's the, uh, the people that are at Kindillan that make this place come alive. Uh, instructors that are out on program are always trying to make it uh, the best possible program for the group. They're always going out of their way to make sure that the group is enjoying the program and getting the most out of it. At Kindle and the staff pride themselves in not only delivering amazing programs but also building relationships with the clients. Once you have been to Kindle, we are very thorough in following up to making sure that our service did reach your expectations. We welcome all clients' feedback with regards to our catering, our maintenance, our programs and our staff, so that if there are areas that we need to improve, we will. We have a lot of adventure activities on site that we, of course, we utilise as part of our outdoor education programs. We have a large lake on site that we do rafting and also canoeing and kayaking and it's absolutely beautiful. We have at the higher end adventure activities, we have a huge range of high ropes. We have a flying fox. We have an 18 metre abseil which incorporates a 12 metre platform and a 6 metre platform that also has a rock climbing wall on it as well. We have a large range of challenge courses. We don't set them up until the morning of the program, so we actually choose which elements we're going to set up that will best deliver your outcomes. So the majority of our outdoor education activities encompass every single person within that group. So for example, if we're running the swing by choice, we not only have the person who is a swinger, but we also have the people who are holding the ladder and removing the ladder. We have the people who are hauling and also the rope retrieval people. So it basically gathers all the team. So you can see that we can design a lot of different adventure activities in your program. When you come to Gadillon, you will notice that the staff are very professional, but they also are having a really good time. What we foster here at Kindillan is what we call the fish philosophy, or it is known as a fish philosophy, which basically means that we need to choose our attitudes when we get to work and with everything we do. Of course, choosing an attitude is about choosing a positive attitude. One other theme about fish is actually play. 
So you will find staff actually engaging with you and having fun with you. So we can have fun and play, but still maintain our professionalism and our outcomes of our program. The third recognition of FISH is being present which means that our staff are here for you at all times. So we won't leave the site until we know that you're very, very comfortable and settled into the campsite. The other thing amongst the Kindle and team we have and we really do foster is to make their day. And basically what it means here is that we're making sure that every single person within a group is having outcomes for their program. So even though we work with teams, we also very much focus on that individual and make their day. The challenge by choice philosophy that we have here at Kindillan always makes every program interesting because you never know what clients are at what level and what they want to achieve. You have some people at the beginning of the three day or five day program refusing to go on any high rope activities or go down to any abseil and on the final day you can see them grow as a person, maybe conquer what they've been trying to the last couple of days, go higher and higher in each activity uh, and push themselves further. No matter what group it is with, it's always a greater result for an instructor if you can get someone with, who has been struggling with certain elements of the program to finally overcome their, their fear or their resistance against an activity and on the final few days for them to actually conquer it. It's a great feeling. With our accommodation we actually have a number of different dwellings on site. We have two large dining halls currently as well as accommodation packages which include bunk style accommodation but also we've got a bit of an upper end of accommodation called the Kuna package which has basically two single beds per room. At Kindillan we have a fantastic team of chefs here and they're really committed to delivering food that is nutritious, it's all handmade here and it also meets your needs especially when it comes to dietary requirements. We have breakfast, morning tea, lunch, afternoon tea, dinner, provided for you while you're on the centre. If you want to know a bit more about Kindillan, please feel free to give us a call at any time, either myself or the client services team and the managers. But also something we work on all the time and are consistently updating is our website. So please have a look at our website and you can be refreshed about what's going on at Kindillan.